A local nonprofit has created an art program to help teachers give children lessons on kindness, compassion, and understanding. And joining us live with all the details is Lisa Hesloff. She is the founder of the nonprofit Children Mending Hearts. Good morning, Lisa. Hi, how are you? We're so We're good. good. Thank you. Okay, so first of all, Children Mending Hearts, 10 years now at least? Yeah, no, we're almost 12. We were founded in 2008. Sorry, I'm really bad with math. I know, it's all good. So, <laughs> so tell me about it, what, what, or tell us about it. What is it all about? Well, we basically founded Children Mending Hearts on the premise that we believe that children should be taught empathy, um, ways to combat bullying and basically how to be kind to each other and we do that through the arts we have an in-school program we have a little school in watts and we have after school programs and our programs our empathy programs are, i think are in every state in the country now so it's very very cool so this art program is, is called kindness counts uh did this just pop in your head one day or how did this all come about no so we have been partnering for eight years with this amazing organization entitled they're called kiki pants and they make the softest most wonderful full clothes you've ever seen in your life and they also have these great books and they really believe in empathy and so we just love their messaging we love we love them we love that they stand for empathy and kindness and so we created this um, program and these grants for teachers to teach kindness uh, for K through second grade. So Lisa, so K through second grade, it's a program and our understanding is that we can nominate teachers only here in California or across the country and then they will get what for that if they win? There, you can nominate teachers all over the country and it's really teachers that that believe in empathy and believe it's important to teach empathy. You know, as you know, we focus on a lot of at-risk schools, schools that don't have access to programs like this. So if the teacher wins the grant, we send an entire toolbox of the whole program, which includes eight lessons on how to teach these kids to be kind and how to teach kindness. Uh, let me let me correct that but anyway so yeah anybody can enter and we've had so many applicants and it's just so moving and exciting to you know to really see these teachers and how much they care about teaching empathy and kindness uh now that the ball's rolling on this uh have you have you had several candidates already that you're looking at oh yes i can't tell you who they are but yes we have <laughs> and it's k through second grade right only through second so we were already really ensconced in uh, third through fifth grade because we really believe that uh, developmental milestone is very important but we had so many requests for teachers K through two who want to teach empathy and kindness and so we thought that this was a great opportunity for her, us to sort of move into that space I don't think a child is ever too young to learn how to be kind and to not bully other children Amen. And I love all the dog pictures in the background. Lisa Heslov, thank you so much. <laughs> Yay. Thank you guys so much for having me. Yes. Well, thanks for coming on. All right. For more, inf for more information about the grant and to nominate a teacher, go to childrenmendinghearts.org forward slash kindness dash counts. And to check out Kiki Pants books and clothing, you can go to kickypants.com.